I recommend Paris and Spain if you want to go somewhere out of the country. I had a dream so big and loud, I jumped so high, I touched the clouds. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. on the street where the bulls run I think is what they do the running of the bulls is on this main street here and then I think we're gonna go to the ring where they do the bull fights and eventually kill the bulls so yes I will get a few clips of the street street where they run this whole street here Oh, hi, Buffy. Hi, cutie. Oh, you are adorable. Hi, baby. And see, they've already started to block off. around and getting ice cream. You can say right? Nope. We better get ice cream or I'm gonna get really mad. And you all know how it goes. That is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Wow. Wow. Hey guys, so you may be able to tell that I am in my room right now and that means that I made it safely back from Spain and I am really sorry that I didn't get a vlog at the airport at all and I have an explanation. It is not an excuse whatsoever, it is just an explanation. So we woke up um, at around 8 o'clock and we left the hotel at 8.30. Then we took a 30 minute um, metro ride to the airport so we got there around 9 or 9.30 and then we um, got my ticket around 10 o'clock. So we ate and then around 10.10 or 10.11 I um, went through security and then I think so you guys know that I wear a ring so I think the metal detector picked up my ring so I had to go over for a little bit and they had to like take something and get the, my handprints or whatever and then that was fine and so then um, I had to ride a train to my gate I don't know how long that took but it was maybe 20 minutes and then I had to um, <clears throat> go through the part where you show your passport to leave the country which took up most of the time like I was in line and they were boarding at my gate and so then I stood in line for a long time and then I got through and I got to my gate and let me just say so my ticket told me that and well not my yeah my ticket really and my information paper told me that my flight started with a four and so um I was like, okay, that's fine. And then on the like the departure board, it um had that number. So I was like, okay, that's good. And then um I got to my gate and it said it was uh leaving for Chicago, but 
it had a number that started with a 6, so I was extremely confused. And by the way, let me just say, I was in boarding group 3, and they were boarding group 11, so that already put stress on me. And so then I got in line because I was like, okay, this must be right. And I got out because I was confused. I got in line again. I got out of line again. And I heard someone speaking English. And I'm like, okay, I'm just going to ask them because I'm giving up at this point. So I asked them. And luckily I was in the right line. And guys, I didn't even have time to go to the bathroom before getting on the plane. Because that is how late I was. And I almost missed my plane. And also, I didn't have a window seat, so that didn't help to get uh, plane shots. So I'm extremely sorry. Again, not, um, not an excuse, just an explanation. But the good news is I am back now, and I really hope you enjoyed my shots from Spain and the Paris vlog because, honestly, I had the best time in Paris and Spain. It was amazing. I already miss everybody there and everybody that I met and... Paris and Spain itself. I already miss it and I already want to go back next year. So, um, yes, I hope you enjoy all the clips I got and I really did have a good time. I recommend Paris and Spain if you want to go somewhere out of the country because they are really good places to go.